Welcome back to another episode of School of Airway. So there's some things that we need to reiterate. And I know Lightscope is a great product. Uh, people love it. But there's things that we need to emphasize. You never want to dip your airway in ragu sauce. And what does that mean? So I've always noticed when people try to use tomorrow or like Ichibei digital even. Uh, no, with a video balloon scope, you have to open the mouth traditionally and go in. But if there's secretions, the tip is what gets covered. And if there's secretions further down that you didn't notice, you brought to the now notice on your screen, I see haziness. So perhaps ideally you can actually lead in with a yank cover. And guess what? And try to pry open the mouth. Use it almost like a glorified tongue depressor. I can just insert the DO blade, and this is not a uh, standard geometric, it's the traditional hyperacute angle of uh, size 3 uh, titanium uh, disposable blade by Glasgow to the mouth. And as you're looking up, you actually wow on the monitor with, as I enter the tip. The tip of this Glasgow monitor will actually show me where I need to actually guide my suction. All the radii in the mouth. Not, I see. When I see badness and I see too much things almost covering the tip of the glycol blade and then me inserting blindly or me in a rush trying to suction. This is going to be used to open the mouth, press the yank hour, and enter the glycol. Will this work with another type of suction device like the decanter catheter? Yes, it will even be better. Look at the holes. One big hole compared to this, it's small little holes here. So even with a better product, can I get this section already? Go in, open the mouth, pry, oh, look at the monitor, it's the answer, it's going to guide me on whether to, where to direct the tip of this suction catheter. Clear it up, and then I have to decide what I want to do. Right. Either go a little deeper, I'm drowning in emesis. Go back, we get to the left side, and intubate with the, uh, I need to preload it with the preferred Glidescope uh, stabbing. Make sense? Again, it does not only work the uh, decanter catheter, it is more efficient in suctioning of voluminous amounts of material. Well, I, know, I know a lot of us have this limited version. Go in the mouth, pry it open after it's been sedated and paralyzed. The baby is cardiac arrest. Go in, visualize. You see there's a voluminous amount of material. So I can as much as possible and hopefully it doesn't get clogged. It's very easy to clog this yank card to size uh, shaped uh, model, catheter model. Bring it to the back end. Hope you don't have to get another one. And hopefully you can now visualize with your glide scope. And it's a bit. Make sense? So I'm teaching now all my residents to lead in with the session catheter, regardless of what they have. Right. Please come back for another episode of School Airway for more Airway basics. Bye bye.